level. Time is ready. On your marks. Get set and go. And he's, in very, very, he's doing it from the hinge. He's turned. He's putting it on the shell. Very nice presentation. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. He's done this before. Doesn't need a glove. Over goes the lid. Cuts the adductor muscle into the shell. There he's got nice plump whiskers he's got as well. This one's causing a bit of problem, so he's going to thump it out of it. There he goes. Oh, oh no, the arm goes down. The what a, that is a nasty one. was a nasty one. He, he agrees with me. He said it was a nasty one. That's technical term in the oyster world. I'm not going to distract him anymore now. Point one. Put it there. Well done. That is damn fine. Give him a big round of applause. There was one there that just wouldn't give. I wouldn't give, and this probably cost me about 10, maybe 12 seconds for that one. Uh, I dropped the knife, another few seconds. Um, so if I had a fair run, I probably got down to about, which I thought, probably a, uh, a minute eight. Yep. At my age now, um, 30 years ago since I... Um, become the fastest always trained in the world um, and I'm happy with what I did and I hope everyone enjoyed their self today and once again thank you to all the oyster farmers up here at Port Macquarie they've done a fantastic job Armstrong's taking your hat off for you also John that owns the vineyard up here John what a great day you put on with the oyster farmers and I hope this continues on for uh, a lot more years yet thanks very much Luke. give a round of applause well done